how do you know you're magical? Well, the powerful forces in this world are invisible. So, for example, think about a tree, and you, you see it, but the invisible part, the roots that get the nourishment from the earth, are mainly invisible. And sometimes you can uncover it with some dirt, and we can see some roots. So the way we've been uncovering our magic is with a word that's safer, manifestation. So I know you've had manifestations that you have helped bring into form with intention, attention, or maybe even miracles that you asked and let go of and it came back in the form of a miracle. Well, this is magic and it's accessible for all of us. There's magic in me, there's magic in you. And with the right condition, we can allow it to emerge gracefully. You know, 50 shades of pleasure, not pain. And our magic is truly waiting for us to turn towards it. And not to come from the head with all the identifying what it is and what it isn't, but more from the heart and even the womb space and connecting these two spaces to be the bridge that we all need to bring this magic out right now in our lives and upon the planet again. It's already there. It's already evident. We just need the eyes to see it and come back to believing and releasing the falsehood of the, the, the two messages we've had growing up that there is magic and there isn't. And, and in our society, we just have to see where it's safe to bring magic out is one month a year in December. And women are all about safety. So the, the first thing I ask you to do is take some of the free classes. One of them is on releasing the fear. So we can actually move into these seven simple steps that will help bring forth your magic because it's already there waiting for you so there's it's audio there's uh, written material there's videos to really support you on your path and then after taking these classes there's a way to embody it through uh, Luna Goddess Yoga and that'll continue the journey even more on this powerful, powerful times that we're living in to really become all of who we are, come back to the oneness, and magic is part of that equation. So please, please, move past the fear and don't die with your magic inside you like countless of women have done in generations past. It is safe now to bring it out, live it out, and love it out. You are magical past understanding. <laughs>